Okay, so this is a different variation for the lace here. Um, something I've just discovered over the last uh, last year. I really like attacking the ankles. Right, and everyone's all about the knees and the defense are work, working towards defending the knees. So I like just going straight for the ankle. So Hunter's going to demonstrate what it looks like, okay, with uh, with a little more space. He's going to come from the outside on the ankles. Okay, the left hand is coming underneath and over top of onto the other calf. And then the right hand is going to go underneath and then just grip right there, just like that. Let's go back. So both hands are dropping, covering. Left hand laces through, while the right hand just cuts across. And from there, bridges, and tightens up as it goes. So you're just gonna keep going here. Back. One more time, and just kind of fall into it. So under covers the legs right there. And this is really hard on your opponent's ankles, and it makes it very difficult to defend. Right? And you're just keeping it nice and tight, ankles on your chest. So now I'll show you what's going to happen if Julian does get a good defense. A lot of people will sit into the person. So sit. Okay, so from here, so Julian's trying really hard to not allow himself to go, so he's sitting hard, sitting hard. Hunter's getting stuck. So something that I like to do, I like to step, knee slide my feet underneath and be perpendicular, getting the feet onto the chest, a small bridge through, and then just keep going. So I very much think the lace ankles is, is a gun wrench. I'm always trying trying to drive my shoulder in and bridge through. So one more time with that. So go flat, do that. So Hunter's covering, drop the hip, yeah. He's gonna step, slide the butt through, yeah. Bridge, and now fold. So that's my variation of the lace angles. 